Oh my goodness, no. Uh Well, that, that's, that's your fiancé, Marth. That is all you, my guy. Oh my god. <laughs> Hello everyone, my name is Linico, and welcome to Five Emblem Heroes. Today, we're just gonna do a nice montage featuring the poster boy of Fire Emblem himself, Marth. He got his resplendent skin, which is, like, really nice. And, uh... I'll talk more about it at the end of the video, but we're just gonna go ahead, get into this montage, and the build that I have for him was really fun to use, and you'll probably soon see why. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I'll leave it to my f past future self, and in the meantime, I need to figure out a good dish that Sheeta cannot fail. See ya! Yeah, Marth looks really cool like this. Hey everyone, welcome to the end of the video. Here is my Marth, he's plus three, plus attack with plus five dragon flowers, and he's running a slaying edge, drawback, blazing light, fury, special spiral three, dry res two, and sweet sparrow two. This is an AoE build, and I'm using it because I don't really like Falchion, the, his in particular, since all it does is make the allies stronger, and I, <laughs> how do you do a montage for that? Like you show, Marth, and then you show the units he's buffing, and oh man, look at those guys. You know what I could have done? I could have done a montage where I had Sheeta fighting, and it was Marth in the back just supporting her. I guess that would have been a little cute thing to do, but nah, I wanted to make Marth an offensive threat so that we can actually use him. Like, I want to get my money's worth out of this, you know? 
Uh, usually with these AoE builds, you run like Defense Smoke or Res Smoke for the respective damage type that you deal. Uh, originally, I wanted to do Wo Dao plus Flashing Blade 4 so that we can get 15 true damage, which probably would have helped us kill things on like our first hit during combat. If we were faster, of course. And that would have been really fun, but I couldn't get those skills, and, which was pretty unfortunate. Other than that, we're running Swiss Sparrow 2 because in combat speed still helps. With Swiss Barrel 2 does nothing for our AoE damage, but it's still, I think it's pretty necessary since we can double things that we probably wouldn't have doubled if we had like Attack plus 3 or Hardy Bearing, which I never ran into Vantage during our whole uh, battle searching. So, yeah. This is a pretty fun build, and for an AoE build that I really don't do very often, this is pretty fun, so I might try it again sometime. But, uh, until next time, thank you all very much for watching. Feel free to let me know what you did with your Marth. Did you make him offensive threat? Or did you make him the ultimate support boy? I'm always interested to know those kind of things. But, until the next video, take care everyone. Probably see you tomorrow for that Loki stuff.